What's up everyone, it's Russo. I hope everyone is doing well. Please follow my Instagram at Russo Lifts just in case something happens to this YouTube channel. You can follow, message, and you can watch my daily story content on Instagram. I'll see you there. What's up everyone, it's Russo. I hope everyone is doing well. Welcome to Return of the Mint episode two. If you guys didn't like from the first thumbnail, like, come on. Give Dante some credit. Like this video. For this video, I'm gonna push Dante in the thumbnail to do Sonic the Bloat Hog in honor of me not getting a fucking haircut in weeks. So, Sonic the Bloat Hog is the thumbnail, but this is meant day three. You know, I feel like super juiced up, nitrogen retention. This is meant only. No testosterone, right? I'm just messing around with like exotic cycles right now. Like I said in my previous video, I'm getting gyno surgery next month and I'm just playing around right now as far as, you know, cycles that people always ask me about. Like people always ask me to do deck only. I tried MPP only, didn't like it. And I'm doing this men only to see what that's like. Yeah, I'm getting crazy results. We'll see how I look in the gym today, but I feel fuller, I feel the nitrogen retention, but the blood pressure is suffering like crazy. And you guys saw me yesterday panting in the gym. I went home, did a bunch of raloxifene, aromatized inhibitor. I'm really trying to keep the estrogen under control. But you know, the more I read into it and the more I just know about men in general, it's literally impossible to keep this estrogen under control. So it's like I'm fighting a losing battle, but I am just documenting the stress alone for what it is most powerful bulking steroid in my opinion ever and yeah you're gonna deal with the insane amount of e estrogen you know i heard and seen guys in the forums that are using letrozole to try and offset the estrogen reflux and even that doesn't work but you know i'm gonna give it like another episode probably and i'm gonna cut it but i am gonna like do a final physique update next episode but today I am going to be deadlifting. Hopefully over 550 pounds, we'll see how I feel. Otherwise, I'll be doing a central nervous system style back day. But Dante really wants me to set a new PR. I personally don't want to fucking injure myself because I don't fucking train for strength that often. But I think it's doable as long as it just feels smooth and easy. You know, I'll work my way up on a deadlift for you guys. But we're going to get started because if you guys haven't watched the car channel yet, Dante did an excellent job at putting together the first car vlog. So check it out. I'll have Dante like throw up a snippet of the car video. That is the reveal of my track hawk. And yeah, the car channel is officially fucking live. I have three different car bells I'm gonna be highlighting as well as working with the best tuner in Pittsburgh to create car content with and review all his customers builds. So it's a gold mine of content. I appreciate, we're almost at, well, we had 99 subscribers last time we checked mm -hmm. on with it. Yep. I appreciate everyone who just subscribed right off the bat. So I'm gonna link that down below too, but we are gonna be going to the gym training back. Like I said, I'm gonna deadlift right off the bat for some shits and giggles and then get to it. As far as what I'm going to do pre-workout wise, I am so lethargic from this ment that I'm probably just going to keep it stem free. So I'm probably going to go with some nitric. This is my favorite product from Gorilla Mine. This has the, <laughs> this has the 10 grams of L-citrulline in two scoops and it's pure L-citrulline. It's not citrulline malate, which sucks. It's real citrulline. And yeah, I'm taking, um, my organ support pills from Enhanced, and I'm also obviously taking the fucking Diuretics. I'm gonna pop even more. I was peeing all day yesterday, just peeing straight water all day. These 100% work, but I'm fighting a losing battle. I'm fighting a losing battle with the estrogen. I'm fighting a losing battle with the water, but I can say, and Dante can say that we did the only men only fucking cycle on YouTube. So. These two, and then I have an intra drink already made. Intra drink is one scoop of Carb Tech, which is a you know multidextrin intra workout carb drink. 
and then anabolic IV, so some essential amino acids. So I'm gonna drink this, maintain fullness, prolong my pump, you know, once I start, like, after I'm done with the deadlifting shit. But we are going to fucking Amerifit. So Amerifit's probably the most hardcore dungeon gym around here. Dante and I have, you know, been there a couple times. Possibly thinking about making it one of my daily driver gyms because it's only 10 minutes away from my new house and I like the atmosphere and if we can find the sauna in there that kind of just checks all the boxes because I've been married to LA fitness which you guys know how I train that LA I'd much rather have a different environment with just my two cents but you know the sauna the sauna is what keeps me in the LA coming back so Amerifit has a sauna. I will also be riding the Ducati there, so Dante will get some video of me setting off in the Ducati. And he's going to be taking the track hawk because we are getting the Ducati. I roasted my rear tire going like 190, and yeah, it's on wire. I need a new tire, and I'm going to switch my tires from a single ply compound, like a super soft tire, to I'm going to switch it to more of a double ply compound which means that the center of the tire is harder so I can last longer on the highway so we're gonna begin the Ducati done I'm gonna be motor vlogging with my friend Whitney with the Ducati he's gonna be buying my S1000 double R off me and we are gonna be doing um, motor vlogs with the headset so we can talk to each other so yeah a lot of stuff in the works as far as content wise goes for you guys and I am still trying to catch up on all my business shit so for everyone following me that um needs to get a hold of me i apologize but you know with dante we're just trying to work out a workflow and keep that going as well as you know keep me buzzing so that's the itinerary for today i will see you guys at the gym and yeah i'll see you guys i dress for the slide not the ride no squid. Why is it all these fucking Harley riders that squid? Huh? Huh? I wanna know. All my Harley riders, like, do you guys wear leathers and shit? Do you wear helmets? Maybe it's just the Harley riders around here, but... You know, when I post in my, my death rockets on Instagram, I got all these Harley guys like, get a real bike. It's like, wear some real gear on your real bike, you know? I don't know. Hope you have organ donor on your fucking license. So yeah, like I said, if you want any bike, I'm be motor vlogging, so that's where you put the camera on the helmet with the mic and talk. But any car content, I'm finally doing my channel. First video is already up. But yeah, Dante, take a look at this back tire on this thing. It is hooked. Look at that. <laughs> God. That is riding on wire. Russo versus the Bumblebee. Bumblebee, that's a fucking yellow jacket. Yeah, for really. For the eco. <laughs> for the Russo Wildlife Conservancy. <laughs> Dude, look at it. Like, the... Ryan, you, you have like the world's most dangerous trash line. You're not afraid to hold it, but it comes to a wasp. No. So, what are we hitting today, Ryan? You said deadlifts or what else? Deadlifts and like heavy central nervous system back, so. T bar row, stuff like that. I already did like pump work back last session, so I'm gonna try and get heavy. And you know what I for oh I probably forgot my fucking gym bag. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. You have the figure eights and a belt? I don't got a belt. Alright, well that changes some things. 
So, now that I know that I don't have my belt... Let's see if they have a belt in there. Let's see if they have a belt. If not, more pump chasing, I guess. You know, actually bodybuilding what I'm supposed to be doing. But, I don't know, yeah. Chris Bumstead's been looking pretty beef with his deadlifts. And no, Bumstead trains, like, he still power builds. Like, yeah. that, that's I respect that. That's the mentality you need, Ryan. You need to start power building. Maybe that's the game changer. Just, just being consistent for me is a game changer right now. All right, let's hit the session or so. All right, guys, so Jim Bag's in the girlfriend's car because I did cardio last night. Just gonna do pump work. I can't really, you know, I'm not gonna push my central nervous system if I'm not belted because I don't train for strength that much anymore. So yeah, we're just gonna get a quick pump. This gym's awesome, very dungeony atmosphere in here. And yeah, I'm gonna just get going and then we'll do some posing clips and then, yeah, I'll wrap it up. But the nitric really did help bring down my blood pressure versus when I did stim yesterday. Like I did that stim pre-workout stack. This time I kept it stim free and it's all vasodilation. So I feel a lot less lethargic going into this workout than I did yesterday. Like with arachidonic acid, I haven't taken it in a while, but what people need to realize is like, I was using it for arms, but it builds up everywhere. So like my back is in so much pain doing these little mediocre weights. So check out arachidonic acid. I'll have Dante throw up the card video of me explaining exactly what it does, but it's one of the unknown natural supplements that actually work, but I'm on a lot of it right now, so that's why I'm not training as heavy as I thought. All right, guys, so Noob forgot his workout shit. Not gonna train heavy. I'm just gonna do like volume circuit work and um, just get a crazy pump. Use the arachidonic acid to my advantage, so it's just gonna be straight painful pump. So not super heavy weights, but really just pushing the blood, the drugs, and the trestolone around. Get one done. I'm gonna make up another one as I go. Try that out. That's really cool. I've never used this machine before. I, how do you say this? I carry it. Yeah, okay. very good contraction. That looks cool. Very like good table feel. More delts. More locks. I could be a bodybuilder. You so you look like a kid in the candy store. So in here. far, I'm really digging the Marifet. I feel like this is going to become the daily as long as I can get their sauna to turn on because. I mean, saw on our side. This gym is. This is gonna be. This is gonna make a break. I'm there so. Check it out if you're from the 412 area. It's all stimulant. Yeah, I feel so much better. Like I wasn't bullshitting yesterday when I like felt like I was like panting and fucking. Like after Dante left and recorded me for Ment Vlog 1, like I was on the Stairmaster walking on level 6, like just like I feel so much better just using the nitric on Ment, so absolutely zero stims if you want to mess with Trestlone, but like Dante can attest, like have I not like like nitrogen retention like exploded? Yeah, you look a thousand times better than you did on red. Yeah, it's just like freaky. Like, it's fucking like 
out the way, Derek, you know? I'm getting there. So that workout was just a dub, but these are raw vlogs, you know, I'm coming back, getting back in shape, and I'm just recording them as I go, you know? I think for like when I prep, I'm gonna do a Marifit, honestly. I like the crowd in there, I like the staff, it's very well kept, and there's a lot of cool, unique machines, and I just need to get out of LA Fitness as my, as my daily. You know, Dante's really trying to get me out of the boring LA life. They have a sauna in here as well, so, you know, that's very important for my water retention ass. But otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to do Ment, like, two or three more days, if that, and then, yeah, I will get some posing footage, but the estrogen is insane. If you plan on running this, I hope you have letrozole or something to maintain it, because even with letrozole, like... If you plan on blasting mint, you're going to be running into blood pressure issues, estrogen conversion issues, and yeah, I just feel like super winded, but the non-stim pre-workout nitric helped at lowering my blood pressure. I didn't feel lethargic during the workout like I did yesterday on the stimulant, so definitely won't do any caffeine whatsoever, any vasoconstrictors, just only vasodilators, so... I hope you guys are enjoying all the new content. I love uploading all the time. I'm much happier these days and I just enjoy, I'm just going to enjoy when it's like January and like I'm back in the swing of things and I look back on this and I'm glad that I grinded out of it. So I will see you guys in my next video.